A cry for help posted along a busy road. Neighbors in one community in Clay County desperate for help with a problem road. After we saw the sign, we got to work asking the State Department of Transportation what can be done. News Channel 3's Kim Rafferty is on scene with the latest. This road sign sits between the areas of Queen Shoals and Clay along Route 4. An area residents tell me they hope their road gets fixed. It's absolutely horrific. It's terrible. I mean, people's bending their rims, busting their tires. You see them by the road changing tires until they patch them, and then they just eat out real fast. It, it don't really do any good to patch them. For 20 years, Teddy Osborne says he has watched the road he drives daily crumble in front of his eyes. Three feet wide into the hard road, and they have little yellow caution signs up so you can go around them. Route 4 is also known as Scenic Elk River Road. Neighbors say it is heavily traveled by semis, school buses, log trucks, as well as people who live nearby and tourists coming to kayak. John Kelly doesn't travel Route 4 much, but he says he's been in the area to scout out a kayak trip and couldn't help but notice the big sign and the road's condition. The other day it was terrible. It was like a minefield. I mean, there was you couldn't you couldn't dodge the potholes. If somebody is kayaking or coming here from out of state, um, it's a very beautiful scenery. To see a sign like this, this takes time and effort. That means these people are tired. That means it's been a long time. So that's not a good impression to give to, to visitors. When John posted on social media about the road, I saw the photo and reached out to the Department of Highways to see what could be done. I sent a spokesperson a list of questions, including what projects are being done to fix the road conditions or issues on Route 4. A spokesperson responded saying in part, there are numerous projects planned to improve Route 4 in that area, including a resurfacing project that would let for bid on April 11th. However, we checked the bid lettings and did not see any projects listed for that area. A spokesperson also said crews plan to repave across the county line in Clay County, but that project isn't scheduled to happen for another two years in 2025. So I followed up asking the spokesperson why the project in Clay County won't happen until 2025 and if they could provide more information on the project on the Kanawha County side of Route 4 since it does not appear on the website. I have not yet received a response to those questions. As for neighbors and John. So yeah, I thought it was pretty interesting that somebody in the local area has had enough of it and they made a giant billboard. They just want to see something done sooner than later. People who live nearby tell me this sign has been up for about a month now. We'll keep reaching out to the DOH for answers to our questions and for possible solutions. In Kanawha County, Kim Rafferty, WSAZ News Channel 3. All right, thank you, Kim, and we will keep you updated once we hear back from the Department of Highways.